Hello and welcome back to our Miami Hurricanes Death Penalty Dynasty in NCAA Football 2008. Tonight we're going to be taking on the 6th ranked Oklahoma Sooners. Let's take a gander at the schedule here. There it is. Now we're coming off a tough loss in our first game of the series against the Florida A&M Rattlers. They came into the Orange Bowl, beat us 31-24. Uh, it was a rough showing. We we did uh, we showed some promise in there though. You know we were doing some good things. Uh, just got to clean up some some drop passes and uh, yeah maybe sustain some longer drives. But yep, yeah, we're gonna probably get destroyed here tonight against the uh, sixth best team in the nation. But we're gonna go out there and we are gonna give it our all, guys. And it's gonna be on TV. Let's make sure we got the uh, commentary crew on. Just for the opening, of course. I gotta turn that up, don't I? I don't remember. Alright. There's the matchup. Who we got in the chat? Jonathan, how you doing? Finally got a notification I'm streaming. Nice. Make sure you got that little bell on, you know? Marvin Joseph. Got work in the morning. That's alright, buddy. Go get that money, my friend. I'm only going to be playing one game here tonight. I'm going to try to just limit this series to one game a stream. I might do some games off stream and just upload them uh, like I used to. I'm not going to be editing the videos, though. There's not going to be any, you know, 20-minute videos or 15-minute videos on the channel. I just, I don't have it in me to edit. So, not anymore, at least. You got the notification bell on and it still doesn't work? Oh, my goodness. I hate YouTube sometimes, you know? It's just terrible. <laughs> well, if you are in the... Uh, oh boy, that's what we need, infractions. If you're in the Discord, I also post the games in there as well when I go live. Uh, there's a link in the, dis uh, in the description for the Discord. As I'm trying to post the stream in there right now. Do, 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 do. All right, so a couple of infractions here. Nichols is involved in a recent fraud scandal. Uh, wow. Yeah, we're going to have to give him... We're just going to give him one game, I guess. I don't want to waste all of our discipline points this early. All right. All right, that's shared in the Discord. John Perez, what's going on, brother? He doesn't take exams seriously. I mean, come on, man. What are you doing, bruh? With your 70 speed. All right, let's go get crushed by the Sooners, guys. Like I said, this will be the... Uh... Oh, that's where all white. Let's do it. It's going to be on the game tonight. I mean, it is uh, quarter after 11 Eastern Standard Time right now. So, Tyler Rocky in the chat. What up, Tyler? Yeah, this game's going to be real tough. Don't forget to slap the like button, guys. Subscribe if you're new. It's going to be a lot of this series on the channel. Because I plan on just doing it forever. Until, you know, the dynasty is completed. Also, let me know how the, the sound, you know, like the volume is and, and everything. Make sure the game is not overpowering me at all during the game. Oh boy, here we go, fellas. A bunch of walk-ons, seven recruits, 
taking on top 25, top 10 Oklahoma Sooners. There's 30 mile an hour winds here today in Norman, Oklahoma. Man, let's get the audio off here. All right. And we're going to kick it off to start the game. Blackstock, ready to boot it. It's Miami. You wouldn't be too focused on studies either. You know, I, I really can't disagree with you there, Marvin. Come on, boys. Get him. All right. They didn't return the opening kickoff for a touchdown. So let's go. We're going to try to run zone coverage a lot because, well, if we don't, we're just going to die. So I'm going to use Mitchell. Mitchell. Let's go. Coming off uh, a tough loss against Florida A&M last week. You know, what was it, 31-24? to 24. I mean, the first two offensive plays for the Rattlers last week were, were just big touchdowns. You know, they had a lot more speed, a lot more talent on their team. And that's just an FCS school. This is, this is a top 10 program in Oklahoma. Taking on a team that's worse than FCS programs, so... Good tackle, Walker. Cornerback needs to get back there a little bit quicker. Jerry Green, what's going on, brother? All right, we're not going 4-6. Let's go nickel normal. Uh, cover two. I just don't want to give up a bunch of big plays. I want to at least have the defense uh, try to make them, you know, sustain some drives. There we go. Good tackle. And for the offense, you know, uh, we're not going to be able to really beat these guys deep at all. I'm going to try to get the run game going a little bit. And just try to get our offense rolling. Sustain a couple drives at least in this game. And give ourselves some, uh, you know, something to look forward to against some lesser opponents. That we actually have a shot at beating. Get him. Heisman candidate. Uh, McMillan taking off. John Heath injures his knee on the play for the Canes. That's unfortunate. We don't really have a lot of talent, so it's tough to see one of your guys go down. There's it's not a whole lot underneath him on the depth chart. All right, third down and three for Oklahoma. Let's see if we can get the stop on to a field goal. Be a little victory for ourselves. Play action. No, he's going to hand that off, and Coles has the first down. Too easy. They're just too fast for us. Really not a whole lot we can do about it. Try to keep them in front of us. Try to limit the big plays. Which I'm impressed that we even got them to a third down situation anyway. Option. Nice tackle by the corner again. And that's the kind of play that we need. That was Sutton. Comes up, lays a pretty good hit, and no gain on the play. Second down and 10 coming up from the 11-yard line. Let's go, boys. To the end zone, and there's two receivers wide open. Walker took about a day and a half. Oh, my goodness. Took a day and a half to get over there to try to cover it. Cornerback was just sitting by the goal line. He wasn't much help. It's alright. We made him work for it, though. They definitely had to work for it. About a two-minute touchdown drive for Oklahoma. And our freshman quarterback, Brent Brown, on the offense will be set to take the field here in a moment. See what they can get going for us. Now, we did have a kick return touchdown against Florida A&M last week, as well as a punt return touchdown. Let's see if we can get a little bit of uh, special teams magic here today with Brown. And not on that one. Decent field position to start off, though, at the 29-yard line. See if we can get the ground game working. A little halfback slam. Heath out for the game with knee bursitis. So down another player on the defensive side of the football. And Lewis crushing the backfield first play of the ball game. Let's 
not how we want him. The drive to start going backwards. Have to throw it a little bit. I know I saw Green open there for a second, but oh my goodness, massive hit on the quarterback. Eight yard pickup for Brown though. Now he's gonna have to do that quite a bit in this game to try to keep us uh, sustaining some drives. They're down three coming up. Wide open over the middle. And Smith, he's going to fumble it. And we get a great play there. We move the chains. And the young freshman wide receiver can't hang on to the football. Putting the defense in a bad situation to start off this next drive. Hand it off, and that's Coles. He's got the touchdown, or uh, he had the big first down run on, I think it was third and five earlier on the last drive. We almost stopped him. Let's try to contain him, keep him in front of us. Second down and five. Let's go, boys. They're going to throw it. They got a tight end wide open, but McMillan's going to take off and move the chains anyway. Ball at the 36-yard line of Miami. They're going to hand it off to the fullback this time. And he's going to get four or five yards up that gut. And I'll bring up second and five. I'm afraid to do a lot of man coverage here. We don't have the speed for it. But I'm going to try it anyway. Play action. Wide open. Is Manning good tackle by Mitchell, who led the team in tackles last week against Florida A&M? I think he had like ten or eleven. Let's try quarterback spy. Sooners seven trips to the red zone this season, seven touchdowns. Very efficient offense. And number seven is uh, Demarco Murray at running back. Oh, he's wide open. I'm covering three guys with Mitchell. Man, that was too easy of a touchdown. This is going to be tough sledding early on in this series. First two or three seasons, we're probably going to get smoked by a lot of these, uh, a lot of these top tier programs. Like, I don't even know if we're going to win a game this season, guys. Florida A&M, that was our best shot at a win. Uh, let's see. I think we got Florida International and Duke. Those are probably. Our only other chance is to actually get some dubs this season. But we're not building for right now anyway. We only got seven recruits in the offseason. Didn't get a whole lot of recruiting points. We had, what, 24 points for some reason. Even though I put 70% of our school budget uh, into recruiting. So we'll see how that goes uh, in this next offseason. See if we can get some more transfers as well. That would help out this program tremendously. Think we we'll get it right by season three, John? I think so. I mean, give me give me three, four seasons, and uh, you know we'll probably be in bowl games. And I don't think we're going to be competing for the ACC title anytime soon. But I mean, that's the whole point of this series, anyway. I wanted more of a challenge. I want to build a program from the ground up, and what better way to do it than uh, you know with my favorite school? Two yard carry for Lewis. Think we're going to go 0-12, Tyler? You know, you, you might be right, buddy. It's going to be tough. And that's picked off. Tight end got pushed aside by the linebacker. And Bell has the interception. That was a bang-bang play. Could have been pass interference. They didn't call it. And the tight end, I mean, he's got he's to try to come forward a little bit. You know, come back to his quarterback just a touch there. And you might be able to get that ball. Season 7 will be in the hunt for the conference. Yeah, that'd probably be a good timeline. About 6, 7 seasons maybe. And Hansbro 
as the catch up to the 15 yard line for Oklahoma. 18 yard pickup. McMillan with a nice pass. I'm not sure how many seasons the dynasties go uh, in 08. I can't remember. I've never done a full dynasty in this game before. But whatever it is, we're going to do it with this team. And off. And a great tackle by Mitchell. That's DeMarco Murray, a.k.a. Coles. I believe he's a uh, sophomore in this game, or a retro freshman, one of the two. Sooners looking to go up three touchdowns here. Quarterback McMillan tries to take off, and I think he got past the line of scrimmage. So that's not a sack, but it is third down and six for this Miami defense. Let's go, boys. Let's get this stop. Hold him. Watch the quarterback run. And that's a first down. Luke trying to force the fumble. That'll be a face mask. They're not going to get too much more yardage out of it since they're so close to the end zone. And Oklahoma moving the chains up to the one-yard line. See, again, we had him stopped. That's the second time in this quarter so far that we had him stopped on third down. And they just they just wanted it more. So things that we definitely have to improve on if we want to try to get some wins this season. And there's a nice tackle. Okay. I like the effort there. No gain for Oklahoma. Second and goal coming up. That was Graves on the stop. The young D-tackle. Get him again, boys. And he's got it again. Touchdown, Oklahoma. We got in the backfield, but just not enough push to get him backwards. And after winning, you know, national championships and every other series that we've done on the channel. Nice to come in here and just not dominate for, right from this jump, you know? Even with a poor roster, you know, we were still doing some great things with, you know, with Kansas and North Carolina. Heck, Mississippi State as well. All right, Brown, let's get it, brother. I do like some of these young players on this squad. They just have to have to be a little bit more consistent. You know, I know it's only week two. Well, game two. I'm, I can't even remember what week we're actually in. Is it week three? Could be. Who knows? But game number two here. I'd like to see these receivers hang out of the football a little bit better. Throw it to the tight end. I'm not sure why... It, didn't switch me to the tight end after he caught it, but okay. Nice five-yard pickup. Let's try to get some yards on the ground here. I don't want to do too many outside runs. We don't have speed, obviously. We do have three freshman linemen that we recruited. So that's the strongest part of our roster. Uh, but they're just not there yet to be able to block these juggernauts on the defensive line of Oklahoma. That's going to be the end of the first quarter as well. 21-0 Oklahoma on top. Not really a big surprise here. In Norman. I would like to get some points on the board, though, before this one's said and done, you know. We got a third down and six. This is like when Howard Schnellenberger took over Miami. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, they were a really, really bad football team. Oh, nice play by the linebacker. Jumped it. And, well, at least it wasn't picked off. We're going to have to punt it away. Get our punter some work. This is Blackstock. He had some pretty good punts last game, and he's kicking with 30 mile an hour winds behind him. So this should be a decent kick, I think. And that is really good. Almost out of bounds inside the 20 yard line. The wind definitely helping him out there. He doesn't have the strongest leg. You know, being <laughs> being a walk on punter. We snagged our kickers from the soccer team. Toss play, look out. And a great play by Mitchell. Let's go. 
That was a beautiful tackle. Second down and nine coming up. I'm going to blitz a corner here. See if we can't catch them off guard. Now, uh, we do have to be aware that some of their linemen are probably faster than everybody on our defense. So, don't want to get caught out in the open. Oh, my goodness. All right, well, we forced the bad throw, sending the corner off the edge there. And we got ourselves a third down and nine. Let's go nickel, normal, cover three. Audible here. I'm covering the middle with Mitchell. Come on, boys. No, Brown. Ah, dang it. He had him in coverage. You know, he was doing good. He just he just didn't have the speed for it. Obviously, that's uh that speed's not something that you can coach, so <laughs> unfortunately, with all the walk-ons, you know, we don't have we basically have no speed on this roster. I think the fastest guy we might have is, let's see, quarterback's got some some speed. <laughs> might be the quarterback, who knows. Maybe the linebacker that we recruited. But just like that, Oklahoma on top. 28-0 uh, here in the second quarter. All right, let's, let's get something going here on offense. For that 77 yard touchdown pass to Brown. And here's our Brown from the 10 yard line. And he's dropped at the 22. We have 22 yards of offense so far. Like to get that number around 300 a game with this roster. I think that's pretty reasonable. We're gonna try to go deep left side. One on one coverage, nice deflection. Now since we don't have the speed to outmatch the cornerbacks, we can still beat them with deep balls. We just have to throw it perfectly. You know, hit them on the outside shoulder. Well, that's gonna be tough with a true freshman quarterback in here. Oh, there's another drop. See, we got to clean those up. I think we had we had a handful of drops last week. Six, seven maybe. There was quite a few. And a lot of them were pretty crucial drops as well. You know, third and long situations where we had our guy, you know, past the sticks. I uh, just couldn't hang on to the football. And not a good throw from Brown. Kind of falling backwards for some reason. When he threw it, man, we're going to have to punt it away again. Yo, what up, Daryl? What's going on, brother? Right, we're just going to kick this deep. And this is probably going to be a good return, to be honest. Good tackle. There you go, boys. Good teamwork. All right, defense. We've had them stopped third and, you know, for third and five, third and nine situations and just let them have it, you know. Man, there's a direct snap. Oh, my goodness. And there's that speed. DeMarco Murray, a.k.a. Coles, in the end zone for the touchdown. How many punts are we going to do in this game? As many as it takes, Tyler. I mean, we're going to do this realistic, you know, I'm not going to, we're, we're not going to win this game, of course, so I'm not going to go for it on every fourth down and just get crazy. We're going to play this realistic, as you would in real life. We know we're outmatched. Hey, we nearly got a block there. Good job by the special teams. That man is massive. Is that uh, number 18? That's Jermaine Gresham, I believe. Let's go, Brown. Putting in that work today, son. Let's go. And decent return up to the 27-yard line. And let's let the coach pick some plays here. Wide receiver slants? All right. See what we can do.
There we go. Good catch by Smith, and we're going to move the chains. Let's go, Canes. First first down of the game. Small victory there. X hitch. All right, coach. Brown, 3 of 8, 25 yards and a pick. There's been uh, several drops in the game as well, so don't just put that all on the quarterback. Up top, and dropped by Brown. Man, really good throw from Brent Brown, the freshman quarterback. Just receivers, they need to hang on to it. All right, let's try a counter. I don't think we have the speed for it, but we're going to give it a shot anyway. This could be good. We get some decent blocking over there on the right. Get him, boys. No, just don't have the speed. Their defensive line is faster than everybody on our offense, so. I think for our, our running attack, we're going to have to stick to isos, dives, you know, slams, stuff like that. Passing game, I think we can have some success. We just need to hold on to the football. See, there we go. That was a perfect throw from Brent Brown. And Green just can't hang on to it. We're going to have to punt it away again. Fourth and 13. Uh, we did have some improvements on that drive, though. Got a first down. Uh, but then, you know, the drops just came back to bite us. And the left-footed Blackstock boots this one away. And that's going to go out of bounds around the 20-yard line. Perfect kick by the freshman walk-on punter. And that was inside the 20. Beautiful play. I'm going to back up the coverage every play. Now, the schedule doesn't get any easier after this. We're taking on ranked Texas A&M. Now, like I said, I'm going to try to just do one game per stream. I don't want to get burnt out either. I feel like uh, in the Kansas Dynasty, I was doing just way too many games in the streams and getting burnt out. I think if I just try to do one game a stream, uh, I think that'll be fine. And if I don't stream, I can still record the games and just upload them. You know, if my uh, depression's kicking in and I'm just not in a whole uh, in a in a social mood, you know. And Mitchell is not going to get the tackle. Who got him? 56 on the stop. Cole's averaging 10 yards a carry. My goodness. I did a whole season in a stream. Yeah, and then YouTube was like, you know what? This stream was too long and too good. So we're going to cut off the last two and a half games. And they're gone forever. Get them, boys. Oh, what a juke. Uh-oh. Good tackle by the strong safety, Walker. Yeah, I don't think we'll be doing another uh, full season stream again, but... I wanted to see if I could do it, and I did it. I mean, I probably could with Miami, especially this season. It would have just been a 12-game stream, but... <laughs> and there's an overthrow. Second and 10 coming up for McMillan in the Sooner offense. And as another touchdown, oh my goodness. Just too easy. It's alright, this is to be expected. Forty one to zero. Let's block this extra point. Let's go. And we do not block it. 42-0 here in Norman. They're just uh, just running rough shot on us, you know? It's going to be rough, rough for this whole season. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it, though. You know our first win is just going to feel so good. I think loading and recruiting in between took took forever in that stream. Yeah, you're probably right. 
Just add a lot of extra time. Oh man, Lewis crushed. Starting to look like the uh, 1950s, 60s, and 70s Miami Hurricane teams. They did have, you know, one or two okay seasons in those years, but other than that, they got spanked every game almost. All right, Brent, let's get it, brother. They got no respect for his uh, his arm strength here, so and I don't really blame him. Although he is the best player on our team, and no blocking. My goodness, they blitzed all the linebackers. It looks like. All right, third and eighteen coming up. Let's try to hit a corner route, maybe a post on the right side. Brown or Smith? And Brown drops another one. Goodness gracious. See, we have the quarterback. I, I, I know we can win with Brent Brown. The receivers, though, right now, I'm not so sure. Like, yeah, they're all walk-ons. I understand that. But at some point, somebody's got to step up and make a play for us. Come on, Sutton. All right. Show me Sutton. Let's go. They're probably going to have their backups in now. Well, it looks like they still got their starters in. So the second half, they'll most likely take all their guys out. Toss play. Man, that's a nice tackle. Even though one guy got absolutely just bowled over. Oof. It was Hudson on the stop. Parker Thomas in the chat. What up, Parker? What's going on, buddy? All right, here we go. Just want the defense to get a couple stops in this game. My goodness. 26 yard pass from McMillan. Oklahoma just having their way with this defense. Yeah, I'm running zone because we don't have the speed for man coverage whatsoever. But even the zones are just getting shredded at this point. Just gonna have to back up the secondary on every play. There we go, Henry. Let's go. Let's go, buddy. Six-yard return as well. And that's a big-time stop for this defense. See, it's all it takes. A little positive plays here and there. Get something going. Get some motivation for the young guys. Like seeing a little bit of fight in them. And we still can't audible. The crowd's still in it for some reason. <laughs> Alright, here we go. We got a man open. And it's caught by Smith. Let's go. First down inside Oklahoma Territory. Beautiful throw from freshman quarterback Brent Brown. Double coverage. Fit that into a really tight window. 29-yard pickup. All the way to the 47-yard line. Any timetable for the HCSU? Well, high school football should be coming back in November. Sometime in November, so stick around for that. Oh, tight end's wide open. And he dropped it. Oh, my goodness. we got to catch these passes. Yeah, the high school football alliance will come back in November. What a hit. And then after the high school season, of course, we will have the College Football Alliance. That'll be making its debut sometime next year after, uh, after the high school season. All right, second down and 10. 
Oh boy. All right, we're just going to take the yards. Take the yards, get the first down. Let's go, Brent. I want points on the board before this half is over. I don't care how we do it. Just get on the board. Pointless stats that nobody cares about. All right. Well, oh, no. Oh, my goodness. He still should have caught that. I didn't even throw it to that guy. I threw that to the tight end. But Brown, again, was like falling backwards as he threw it. I had the tight end wide open. That should have been a touchdown. That's tough. Got to capitalize on the mistakes by the opponents. Got to figure it out. Still can't hot route. I don't know how the crowd is still in this game right now. And hit the button to throw it. Pressure got there too quick. It's going to be a loss of 12 yards on the sack. we got to get all those yards back right now. All right, coach, what do you want from us? Motion smash. Uh, I just don't think so, but let's go X follow. Round throwing it up. Oh, my goodness, what a catch by Green. Dragging the toe and gets the first down on third and 22. Beautiful catch. But don't worry. Next time I throw it to him, it'll be a quick slant, and he'll just drop it for no reason. That's how hit or miss these guys are right now. It's mostly miss. All right, 45 seconds left in the half. And sacked again. I mean, just look at all the Sooners in the backfield. Three hurries, three sacks. All right, what shall we do? Let's go angle. Got the out route on the right. Out route on the left. Maybe Brown up the seam. Oh, no. We had green open on the out. Just got hit as we threw it yet again. So unfortunate. Third and 18 coming up. It's all right, Brown. Your numbers, uh, your numbers will improve. Up top, one-on-one -on -one coverage and incomplete. Well... They want us to go for it. Let's see. That'd be a 44-yard field goal. We got 30 mile an hour wins, guys. We got to go for the field goal, right? Got to get some points on the board. All right, Black Stock. Let's go, brother. Kick is up, and Black Stock gets us on the board. There we go. A little moral victory there. 42 to three is the score. There will be no shutout here today in Norman. Beautiful kick. And we will also have the wind again in the fourth quarter. So stick around for that. Get him. Good tackle. There we go. All right, now just don't allow the big play. Please. Please don't do it. All right, everybody get back. There we go. Another small moral victory right there. A sack for Howell. He had one last week against Florida A&M. Just adding to his total. It's going to end the first half. 42-3. to We're getting smoked right now. But we're just going to keep trying. And keep doing our best. See who wants to get out here and make some plays in the second half. Here's Church from his own 10-yard line. And he gets the return up to the 29. Now, was, Oklahoma should have their backups in the game, I believe. And actually, it still looks like their starters are in. Oh, my goodness. I have to play against them for a whole other quarter. That's tough.
There we go. Good run for Lewis. Best of the game for him. Three yard pickup. Oh my goodness. It looked like he got so much more than that, didn't it? Get that block on the left side, Brown. He didn't. He did not get the block. Ran right by the guy. All right, third down and eight. Let's go Z drag. Come on, Brent. Up top and dropped by Smith. Really good throw again from Brent Brown. The receiver just cannot hang on to it. Blackstock on for the punt. This time against 28 mile an hour winds. And still gets a pretty decent kickoff. Oh boy, Glover saves the touchdown there. Two broken tackles from Brown. Almost took that the distance. This is going to be an uphill battle, boys. Just got to keep fighting. Oh, I just bounced right off of him with Mitchell. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Bounced right off him like a pinball. Four touchdowns for Coles in the game. Oklahoma almost has the, uh, <laughs> the good old 50 burger on us here in the third. Extra point up being good. 49 to 3 here in Norman. Number 6, Oklahoma cruising right now. Church from the 14. And dropped around the 29 yard line, just like his last return. Just trying to audible. People can't hear it. Oh boy. And, oh my goodness, we almost had a big-time play there. Just missed him. That's so tough. All right, second and ten. Man open. And he drops it. Oh my goodness. He beats the DB. That's a perfect throw from Brent Brown. Oh, man. DB made just a bad play there. We could have had a big-time play. All right, third and ten. Up top, and nice play by the linebacker. Dang it. Just trying to force that one in there. That's just a frustration interception. You know, you missed that big pass on the previous play. You know, you, you know you had a big play opportunity. And frustration sets in, you just throw a bad pass next to that one, so... Oh, boy. It's a good try by Mitchell. Keeping the running back to the inside of the field. Nobody else there to help him out. And Coles is in for his fifth touchdown of the ballgame.
And it is 56 to 3. All right, church. Let's go, brother. From the 17 yard line and up to the 33. Keep working through it, boys. Man, we're just going to take off with Brown. Avoid contact with their massive linebackers that they have. All right, Tyler, take it easy, buddy. Up top, and another drop. Man, he's just wide open. Just dropped it before he even got hit as well. If you're watching this series for good football right now, you're in the wrong place. But you stick around long enough, and we will rebuild the Miami Hurricane football program. Oh, how do you miss that block? Oh, my goodness. Brown with a great play, getting the chains moving. Let's go, Brent. Great effort from the quarterback. And as soon as we pick a run play, they stack the box completely. And Lewis fight forward. Somehow gets a yard out of that. About two yards they gave him credit for. Okay, I'll take it. Try to hit him with play action. Maybe Green will hold on to the football here. Probably not. And didn't get enough blocking off the right side. A couple guys fell down on the right side of that line. They're down to 13 coming up. Probably going to get sacked here, 100%. Yep, oh my goodness, massive hit on Brown. I mean, how do you guard these guys? They're all just mountains. Black stock on for another punt. He's been pretty busy in today's game. And nice tackle by Smith. You know, I feel like this is what happens to uh, Miles Dawkins at the beginning of all of his series. But that's with good rosters <laughs> for the most part. I have a team that is statistically worse than the FCS schools in the game. Alright, second down and four for Oklahoma. And the user pick for Mitchell. Let's go! That was a really bad overthrow. Not sure what was going on there. But I will take the interception. Good play by Mitchell. Yeah, he overthrew his target by five yards. All right, offense. Let's do something. Yeah, I'll do a wide receiver sweep. Because <laughs> we have the speed for that right now. Get that out of the playbook. The crowd is still in this game somehow, and we cannot hot route or audible. Oh my goodness, another missed opportunity. The DB makes a bad play, misses the ball, and the receiver can't get there to catch it. Missed opportunities. Of course, that's no different than the real-life Miami Hurricanes this season and for the past, uh, you know, 20 years. Oh my. Good tackle, Brown. Brown. <laughs> 
<laughs> Jeez Louise. Yep. That's how this is going. That was supposed to be a bullet pass. And Brown just, you know, threw a, just threw it way up in the air. throw for Oklahoma quarterback is their backup of course so we're gonna see different level of play from under center from here on out and there's a draw play Mitchell with a nice tackle and it's gonna be third down and goal so we have a shot here at a stop here at the goal line Oh, dang it. Really good blocking. Couple pancakes there on the left side of the line. Nothing we can do about that one. About to be 63-3 to here in Norman, Oklahoma. A little over a quarter left to play. And we nearly blocked that one. My goodness. Come on, Brown. And good return up to the 30-yard line. And we have two more plays in Oklahoma on offense today. Most of their plays have been big ones. Got him. There's a good pass out to Green up to midfield. Good route. Perfect throw. Go Seamers. One on one coverage and another drop for this Miami receiving core. That's been the story so far this season. Lots of drops. When your quarterback's putting it on the money, you got to come away with the football. And that was a massive overthrow. That was intended for the running back. And that's going to be a pick six for Oklahoma. About to have a 70-burger on us. Right now they are at 69 for the culture. See if we can block the extra point. Just keep 69 on the scoreboard for just a second or two longer, you know? And we do not block it. 70 to 3. Brown just uh, a little, little erratic with some of his passes in today's game. Man, Brown just decapitated. My goodness. And I want to try to run the football, but every single time I pick a run play, they stack the box like they know it's coming. And yeah, I can't audible either, so. <laughs> just... Just not good. Not a good situation. All right, let's go FL Drive. And 
another drop. It looked like it hit him in the hands there. We are 2 of 11 on third down in the ballgame. A couple of them were pretty long third down conversions as well. Just going to have to throw it up to the tight end. And that is an overthrow again from Brown. Going to have to punt it away another time. Come on, Blackstock. Boot it, brother. Let's go. And gets a good one. No return for Oklahoma this time. Mitchell in the zone right now. He's had some pretty decent tackles. The pick. Walker burnt like toast on the play. Goodness gracious. Oklahoma might put up 100 tonight. I'm afraid to see how many drops we've had in this game. It's more than five. It's got to be. Here's Brown again. Getting a lot of work on kick returns today. Him and Church. And Lewis. What did he get? One, two yards out of it? Two yard carry. Okay, okay. again this time up the middle to the left side and just one yard third and seven now even with the three linemen that we got in recruiting it's still tough to get anything going on the ground and we are sacked instantly my goodness Cannot wait until we get some speed on this team. And that'll end the third quarter. Get your fours up in the chat if you're still out there. We're still fighting. So trying to get something going. Black stock. Ready to boot it away again. He's got the wind at his back once more. Might have outkicked the coverage here. Nice tackle on Lopez at the 35-yard line. Here's Hunter, the backup running back, taken down after one yard pickup. Fullback up the middle this time. My goodness. They're just giving the ball to everybody. You get a carry, and you get a carry. All right, they're down at six. Moral victory here. Let's get the defensive stop. Get the stop. Let's go, defense. 
Punt return time. Would be nice to get in the end zone here today, but I just don't know if that's going to happen. Not with our receivers dropping every other pass. And the O-line just not being able to hold up against this, this really good Oklahoma defense. Crushed again. Man, if he had just another half a second to try to throw that football. Could have got some yards out of that. Or at least connected with the tight end. Here we go, Lewis. Another good run from him today. Five-yard pickup. I'll take it. Wide open, and another drop. Oh, my goodness. Ten hurries, six sacks, four interceptions for the Oklahoma defense, and about 100 drops for this Miami wide receiver team. High snap. Blackstock corrals it, though, and a good punt. And a good tackle by Sutton. Let's go, buddy. We do have some standout players that actually make some plays, uh, but only a handful of them. Oh boy, that's a touchdown. Hunter is gone. Man, that little cut move that he did, I mean, he just went right around me. That's tough. Extra point is good. It's 84 to 3 here in Norman. All right, Brown, let's get it. And decent return up to the 26. Oklahoma with 600 yards of offense. Miami just 93 today. Oh, my goodness. That was an underthrow if I've ever seen one. My goodness. Five interceptions for Brown today. And I think with that, we're going <laughs> to put the backup in. I don't even know who it is. I think our starter has endured enough here today. Let's put in Brandon Jones, number 12. Look at that. Six of 32, 100 yards, five picks. That's tough. Most likely about 10 drops today for the receiving core. Rumble, and we somehow don't get that with two guys all over the football. And those five interceptions is with the AI slider at five. So I might put the sliders at zero for human and computer. It's, it's at five for both right now. I mean, we don't want to see a thousand interceptions in a season. Oklahoma four or five on third down. We stopped them once. And it was a damn good stop, I might say. Oh my goodness, that should have been a pick. 
And then Mitchell, like, backed out of it as well. So it should have been a catch. <laughs> That's just an awkward play. But we do get another stop. We hold him to a field goal. So we are getting some small victories here today. And the field goal is good. It's 87 to 3. All right, Brandon Jones in at quarterback. Number 12. His first little bit of action. You know, just going to hand it off to Lewis, and he's going to fumble it. My goodness. I feel so bad for the defense right now. Oklahoma really wants 100 points today. defense. Stop him again, boys. That was a good tackle. Missed the initial attempt. Oklahoma just running the clock out now. Showing a little bit of mercy on us. Good tackle by Mitchell. That just saved a touchdown. Alright, third down and seven. See if we can't get another third down stop today. And that is going to be a first down. My goodness, the DB was right there to make the play and just couldn't do it. All he had to do was deflect it. Definitely a disappointing performance today, especially the offense. I mean, only six completions today. We had five picks. And that's another touchdown for Oklahoma. But, you know, a bunch of drops today. O-line, I mean, O-line did all they could to try to slow down these, these big hog mollies on defense. I mean, they're just bigger, they're faster, stronger. Hey, we're going to get at least one dub this year. We're going to do it. Can't go on 12, guys. Can't do it. All right, 94 to 3. Just don't let them get 100. Come on. We can just hold on to the football. Well, that's a good start for the drive. Brown, what are you doing? All right, this quarterback is more of a runner. He's got 80 speed. He might be actually the, uh, the fastest player on the team. And he's going to pick up three yards on his first carry of his career. Just going to try to run the clock down, too. Oh, 
boy. And Jones going to take off. Slide. Gets the first down. There we go, young fella. A couple good runs for him to start off his career. Luke, play of the game for Miami. Eight tackles and a forced fumble today. Oh, boy. This ain't looking good. There's a flag for holding as well. That was a disastrous play. That was Henderson. And the clock was stopped because of the penalty. And there's Lewis getting a yard. Got 40 yards on the season. It's crazy that the crowd is still getting this loud this late in the game with the score. Yeah, why not? Chuck it up. Jones doesn't have a great arm. And that's been the story of the entire game on offense. Just uh, just getting crushed in the backfield majority of the plays. Got time for one last play here today. One-on-one -on -one coverage. And it's picked off. And that will do it. 94-3 to is the final. Oklahoma just cruising to an easy win here in front of the home crowd. I knew before the game that we just, we just did not have a chance in hell to win this one. But we did show some promise on some drives. You know, we got some points on the board there in the first half against the starting Oklahoma defense. Uh, but yeah, we are able to move the ball on a few drives, you know, just a lot of drop passes yet again, plaguing the team. And of course, on defense, we just don't have the speed to keep up with uh, a team that's just so stacked like Oklahoma right now. Uh, we had 100 passing yards, just four rushing yards today, 104 yards of offense. They had 634. We got sacked six times. We were two of 15 on third down, eight turnovers, two fumbles, six interceptions today for the Miami Hurricanes. There's a box score. It's sad. But we did make a 45-yard field goal with Blackstock, so we got that going for us. Like I said, we got, you know, we got a couple uh, couple of standout guys that make some plays here and there, but uh, the receivers definitely have to help out Brent Brown. As he was 6 of 32 today. Look at how many drops we've got. Look at that. 10 drops guys Oof. imagine if we had those 10 catches Brown would have been 16 of 32 that would have been 50% he probably would have had over 200 yards we probably would have had some touchdowns in this ball game but got to work on that got to fix it or we're just going to keep getting pounded by these schools oh yeah who had the fumble uh, Nate Lewis had the fumble on offense yeah, I mean, these drops are just crazy. Brown had four drops, zero catches in today's game. Big Geo in the chat. What up, Big Geo? Jay Luke, eight tackles. Jonathan Sutton at six. And Jesse Mitchell with five. A couple tackles for a loss today. Shannon Howell had one and a sack. Ron Hackett had the other tackle for a loss. Interceptions. Tim Henry, the corner. 
and Jesse Mitchell, the free safety, had a pick. Mitchell also had a deflection. Jay Luke had a forced fumble, our middle linebacker. Unfortunately, we could not recover it. Eric Black stocked up punter, hit a 45-yarder, and then he punted nine times today, 40-yard average. Now, that was, of course, with the wind at his back uh, being around 30 miles an hour. Uh, but still, uh, did pretty good. How many inside the 20? He had one inside the 20 as well. So, pretty good day for our punter. And that is it. 94-3 to final. And like I said, I'm going to try to keep this series just one game per stream. Uh, so I don't get burnt out. And might be able to do, you know, more than uh, more than a handful a week. But we shall see. We'll simulate the rest of this week. And our next game is week three. As we're taking on the Aggies of Texas A&M. So that's, that's going to be another tough contest. Uh, probably going to be similar to this one. So, you know, if you want to see another beatdown, you want to see us get crushed, make sure you stay tuned for that one. Of course, we will post that in the Discord when the video goes live. If you're not in the Discord... Go ahead and join us. There's a link in the description below. But here's the matchup. I will leave you guys with this. And I'll be signing off for the night. Don't forget to slap that like button, guys. And subscribe if you're new. Until the next one, take it easy, guys.